America. As you well know, ever since I took office, well, things have been really, really bad. Cut! That seemed like a good one. Is that thing going to be back there the whole time? This fella here over here with the, the yellow shirt, Makaka, or whatever his name is, he's with my opponent. He's following us around everywhere. So welcome. Let's give a welcome to Makaka here. Tangled up tubes. Because he got tangled up with all these things that are going on the internet commercially. I, I think it's absolutely essential to provide streaming stuff going on on the, on the, on the internet. As you might know, I care deeply about stem cell research. Unfortunately, Senator Jim Talent opposes expanding stem cell research. They say all politics is local, but it's not always the case. What you do in Missouri matters to millions of Americans. Americans like me. And that's why I want to tell you first that I'll be filing papers today to create a presidential exploratory. Today that I'm forming a presidential exploratory committee. other people who are hardworking like you. And I've really been impressed by how serious people are because we all need to be part of the discussion. I made the Vote Different ad because I wanted to make a statement about the primary. In 2006, you could say some YouTube videos helped change uh, the result of the election. Hi, I'm Mitt Romney, and I'm pleased to participate in the YouTube Spotlight here on YouTube. So what do you believe? is America's single greatest challenge. I don't want big religion to dictate my morals. I think the greatest challenge facing America is our own image abroad. What is it you're willing to do to free us from the axis of oil? I looked at government incentives for hybrid cars. They don't get that much better gas mileage than other similar cars, and there's a lot better technologies out there. Jamie, I'm reading your response. You're exactly, exactly correct. The uh, fuel efficiency of hybrid cars are not that great. I'd like to find out what's on your mind. I uh, want to hear from you some of your ideas that you're interested in. My name is Chris Dodd, and I'm a Democrat running for President of the United States. Today, we have the ability to bypass the traditional media filters by participating in discussions online through blogs and YouTube. Today, Hillary Clinton is going online to ask supporters and YouTube users a very important question. What do you think our campaign song should be? Hi, everybody. I'm James, and today we're talking about Texas Congressman and Republican presidential candidate Ron Paul. This is the first presidential candidate, or the first interview ever, to be conducted with a presidential candidate from a college dorm room. So it's got to say something about this next 08 election when a guy with a $250 camera in a basement shooting videos for two months and have a sit down with a presidential candidate. Congressman Kucinich, uh, thank you for being here. There's a lot out there happening on the net, including YouTube, that, uh, that is outside the control of candidates and that is not a bad thing. Hello, welcome to the new incarnation of the news in color. I'm David McMillan. So for instance, you won't hear me say that the current White House is the most criminally incompetent administration in U.S. history. Nope, you won't hear any of that from me. I'm a screenwriter. What do I know about politics? Anything look good? We have some great choices. I'm going to be hosting the event, but frankly, I'm not going to be doing very much because it's going to be your questions that are asked and your videos which are shown. So the candidates are not only going to see you, but they're going to have to answer your questions. So be creative. If you want to know a particular subject, ask it. Just uh, keep it clean. 